Oh wow, the goddess here already spawned? I didn't even notice. That's interesting. So two Archstone and then we have an Archstone Fragment. That's really good. I like this one. And then we have the Wondrous Box. Hopefully nobody get this one. Because the uh, Rest Peak is pretty cheap right now. You can expect around 5 million to 10 million silver. So if you get this, that really sucks to be honest. Well, with that being said, I'm not gonna spend any silver to already got its grace. I'm actually saving my silver to buy a new bunch of and then investing into my other characters. Well, let's go back to the video. Flashback. What is going on, everybody? This is Savage and welcome back to another video. And today, I'm gonna show you guys where the Demon Lord Field boss is gonna spawn. So let's go ahead and talk to the Goddess uh, Statue real quick, and we'll teleport to the In the Wall District 10. This is the first location for one of the field bosses. Now, it's pretty cheap to get to this location, you can teleport directly as long as you have the Goddess Statue enabled for this map. What we get here, and let me go ahead and open my map real quick. Alright, so we have 4 Fuel Boss in this location. Demon Lord Herogat is gonna spawn at the War Rooms, and then Demon Lord Mana is gonna spawn at the Central Control Rooms. And then we'll have the Demon Lord Rexifer in the Document RT, which is pretty nice by the way. And then lastly, we'll have Demon Lord Mitri to spawn over here. And that is pretty much for the inner wall district A. Let's go ahead and go to the Python Forest. The next few bosses, which include Demon Lord Zara, Noels, and then Demon Lord Bloods, they're gonna spawn in the Emmet Forest. So let's go ahead and cut over there real quick. Alright, so we're in game right now. And if you notice on my ch uh, chat message, there is a message notification about the few bars that is about to spawn soon, and that is the Demon Lord Blood. Now, as I mentioned earlier, Demon Lord Blood usually spawn in Ammon Forest, so let's go ahead and go through the Pythus Forest first. And we'll walk directly to Ammon Forest. Alright folks, we are at the Fuel Boss locations. This is actually only available for Channel 1s by the way, so make sure you are on Channel 1 before the Fuel Boss spawn. Also, the Fuel Boss spawns 10 minutes after the notifications, and right now is 228, so we have one more minute until the Fuel Boss spawn. Now, Demon Lord Blood spawn over here, Demon Lord Zara spawn over here, and Demon Lord Noel spawn over here. Uh, how many seconds do we have left? Let's see. Alright, let's oh, wait a minute. Okay, so we it is now 2:29, and you can see here on my time bill clocks, we are all waiting for the few bots to spawn. Even though it's already 2:29, it usually take around 30 second after, 30 to 45 second after. So we go and check the clock real quick. Um, so it's 35 second now, so we have 10 seconds. Let's go ahead and up real quick. All right, dang, that's a big Zara. <laughs> this is actually is that Demon Lord Zara? I think it is. Can't really tell. That's big. There's the boss. It's already spawned. Use everything you can do. And kill as soon as possible. Damage ranking does actually apply to the field boss by the way. Now once the field boss got down to the first phase, the second phase is going to heal it up. Let's go ahead and keep doing damage. Oh my, people are dying. Nice, we got it. Do we get it? Do we get the first rank? Rank two. Okay, someone got the last hit. Oh, I didn't get the last hit. Oh, I did have the last hit. Nice. So when you kill the uh, fuel boss, when you get the first hit and the last hit, you actually get a shining cubes, a different versions of the uh, attendant cubes or ranking cubes. This one is actually have higher chance of getting great items. Like for example, you can get something like a really cool recipes for the Linsky's recipe or passive recipe. Those are usually really nice for a physical or magical DPS spells. And the other one is just a normal cube. So let's go ahead and open it. Materials, pretty straightforward. You can also get a Demon Lore legendary card from this cube. So keep that in mind. And we got another uh, spirit material. So that's pretty, that is pretty much about it. <laughs> Alright, I'm back. So, I don't know what happens. I believe this channel was crashed, so I wasn't able to log in for the past 2-3 to three minutes. But with that being said, I want to give you guys some additional information about the field boss. Usually, it takes 8 hours for the field boss to spawn after it got kills. So, right now, it's 2.46. And I believe we killed it around 2.31, 2.32. I, I don't remember. I think the fight was like, it's go really fast. <laughs> there was a few people, but the boss died really fast. So, the next one is going to spawn around 10 p.m. at 31 or 32. You will see a notification on your chat and then you have a 10 minute spawn time so with that, that's pretty easy to remember. 
Now here's the thing with the scale clips and more importantly the field boss. They also have to share the same times at 8 hours but they need to die in order to spawn like, like I said before like I said a few seconds ago. The thing is they take forever to kill. It takes roughly 3 or 4 hours on NA server. Or maybe more than that, I don't even know. Depending on how many people are willing to participate and kill the boss. Then I do really want to ask the NA server to, you know, chip in some of your times and help people to kill the fuel boss. I know if I know sometimes you will not get rain, but you actually contributing to helping the server to spawn the goddess grey. Goddess grey is pretty important by the way. That's where people can chip in their silvers, trying to get the art stone and art fragments and some other goodies. This is the only way for some of the players who cannot go to the field boss or who doesn't really like field boss. But if you have any sometime or maybe you can spare some, that would be much appreciated to be honest. Well, with that being said, this is Sound Team once again and I will see you all in the next videos. Later!